Alright, we're checking out the only games where the more cursed they are, the more they sell. It's mobile games. I love that my very first question in life is whether I want to use a seed to grow a plant or a bird. The circle of life continues. Give me the bird. Oh, it's an actual bird. And you're not growing from the seed. He's just eating the seed. Little seed, big seed. Oh, is that an egg? Give me the big egg. You're just gonna vomit it out? Oh my god! <laughs> I don't know how that egg got into that bird. Well, I don't, I, actually, I don't know how that egg came out of that bird. I've always wanted to give birth to the avian version of Satan. Is that an eggplant with a scythe opening of the egg? What? Are you cracking my egg or are you murdering it? Or are you reaving its soul? I like ice cream. The demon eggplant just set up an ice cream shop inside of the egg. Oh, my seed is back. Yay. All the little eggplants are happy now. Yeah. Oh, all the little eggplants are screaming in fear because the Godzilla eggplant is hunting them down to kill them. This is a game that combines speed, parkour, and agility, which I'm not good at any of those things, so I'm probably just going to be raging until I eventually get to the end. The concept is you have to color coat all of the things that you get to make your neck longer and longer so you can eventually destroy the planet by being, I don't know, some sort of bionic giraffe or something. Now you'll notice right now, getting through all this allows my neck to combine to an even greater height where I make giraffes feel incompetent. And yes, even the Sphinx is nowhere near me. I like how it goes to like a pyramid and then Jesus. To be fair, I'm taller than a dinosaur, but I don't actually have a way to protect myself. So I feel like I'm just a really long chicken finger. Of course, each time you unlock new obstacles that exist only to make my life harder. I think that playing all the GTA parkours <laughs> and having an incredibly high blood pressure has really prepared me for this game. Yeah, we're gonna do blue. Everything's color-coded as well, so if you were colorblind, you would be absolutely screwed! See, now if you touch a color that you're not a part of, then it knocks your neck off. I don't know what happens to your vertebrae, you just like vomit it out of your mouth. I'm also kind of curious exactly how stupid the various sculptures get. New obstacle unlocked. Great, I get to drown in a Floridian pool. You may ask yourself, great, what do you get to do with all your money? You get to do this. I can now be a monkey wearing a banana on his back like it's a katana. I'm going to war. I'm actually using truck tires as my neck now. I also have this king over here. I might as well just unlock as many as I can. God. You know what, we're picking the dinosaur. Actually, it's not really a dinosaur, it's like a derpasaur. This is the kind of dinosaur that went to the prehistoric period and scored like a D minus. So what do I do? Oh, either I drown or I get to survive by having an overpowering neck. All right, so I need to go through here. I should have picked green, but I'm a moron. Over this way, grab the gems, hopefully don't drown again. Then we're going to gold, grab the gold. And then, of course, at the end, you have the wacky inflatable arm guy preparing you for a lifetime of regret. <laughs> okay, I think I might actually have gotten to the pyramids at this point. Oh, yeah. No, nope. oh, I need 30. You would have never known that, like, open-handed Raptor Jesus is 38 neck chunks high. This is how I'm going to measure everything in my life from now on, like my wife and everything. She's going to be like, hey, honey, do you think I've grown? And I'll be like, no, you probably shrank. You're now... 5.3 neck chunks and then she'll be like have you been playing those loser games again and i'll be like yeah cover the gems oh yeah 3.6 right off the bat for doing absolutely nothing i like that i just get to hit bigger and bigger climate changing meteorites i have effectively saved the planet i feel like i'm actually performing in one of those dog talent shows oh, that's a big one i'm actually going to attempt to do like well never mind I was going to say, I'm going to try and do a absolutely perfect run here where I don't lose any necks. Oh! I've got, like, super ballistic mode. This is incredible. Ah! Oh, yeah. Oh, we're going right past the, we're going right past the pyramid. See how impressed everyone is? They're all like, congratulations, you're a 30 foot tall mozzarella stick. Yeah. Now I get to be Ip Man's punching bag. I think I can buy oh, nope. 10,000 coins. Can I just buy them? So now I have to time this. Is that what you're saying? So like, go now? Oh yeah, easy. Okay, this is starting to turn less into like a neck game and <laughs> I was gonna say more into a wipeout game. 
Oh, this has got to be excellent for your back. It's like a chiropractor, but when you leave, you're paralyzed. Fever mode. 62, 60, 71, 75. That was absolutely perfect. I'm getting all of the bonuses. Look at my neck height. Wow, I actually can't see my head. I finally done it. I have defeated Dollar Store Jesus. <laughs> He's like, yeah, we can't use that name. It's copywritten. So my name is Jamesus. All right, here's the one opportunity where I get to see if I can open up a new neck piece. Did I say one chance? I said as many chances as it takes for me to win. You may be asking yourself, Gray, what are you? I'm a depressed king with a gland problem. All right, got to get the mega ring over here. Grab all this. I should not have done that. Nope. Choke myself out on purpose. Woo! Did he did he just make a really sad little sound when he jumped through the air? Like <laughs> real quick. Who did the voiceover on this game? <laughs> I didn't even get to the Sphinx. I betrayed my entire family. Great, now I get to beat myself to death with swinging cheddar flavored Tootsie Rolls. Grab the blue. Whoa. And then gold, Yetus. Oh yeah. Oh, we're weaving. Okay. Into the key. Green we're going for this time. Sometimes I forget what colors look like. Uh, I don't know what happened there. I feel like I should have gotten murdered, but I didn't and I'm just going, ah, blue. This is the one time in my life where I'm not satisfied with gold. I did get all of the signs though. Not going to be happy until I can headbutt outer space. Yep, that was the sound. It sounded like Mickey Mouse, but he's like choking to death. Don't mind me, I'm just destroying the ecosystem. Okay, this is a flawless run. Oh yeah, this is happening. Oh God. Yeah! Yeah! More! Okay, this should definitely get me to new heights. Like literally to new heights. Uh, I'll take the hit. Ah, oh, it's all blue! <gasps> Okay, green, there. That is the highest I've gotten yet. Not only did I get all the bonuses, I'm off the screen. Also, my guy's legs must be amazing to still be doing this. Right past James's leaning tower. Eventually there's a Statue of Liberty and yeet. I love it. Oh, there we go. Uh, yeah, gold. Hey, don't get beat to death. Grab all of those. Yeah, it is! Oh, check it out. Oh, this is happening. This is the thing that's happening. Oh, God. Okay, I don't think that that's better than the last one, but it's still, oh, never mind. 5.2. I like how the game has to zoom further and further out. Pretty soon, I'm not even going to be a human being anymore. I'm gonna be like an atom with a really long neck. I'm actually looking ahead. <gasps> Ow! I'm actually looking at, ow, ahead now, which is something I'm not very good at. Nope. No brain damage. Oh, uh, green. Okay, I mean, I, that was, I've reduced the damage as much as I possibly could. We're getting full bonuses every time. Okay, almost there. Also, I can spend my money of stupidity again. There's only two things left for me to get, and I feel like I'm gonna regret getting either one of them. Yep. I'm going back with the tires. Great, I'm a ninja that looks like he's carrying a sword that he stole from an illegal Ren fair. Sweet. Yes. Look at the speed. Look at the- I can just walk right through this. I don't even care. Hey, kind of dance my way through here. My sword is stabbing me in the anus every two seconds. There we go. Grab all these. Whoa! Okay! But your head really starts to bobble as you get tall. Can I finally go past the Leaning Tower Pizza? Okay, like seven more. I just have to graft the necks of seven dead people on me and I'll be there. I just realized why am I carrying a sword when I can strangle people to death with my own neck? Hey, basically you have to go through a turnstile, but the turnstile is specifically made to murder you. That's good. Get the wheels, grab the green, go through the gauntlet of death. It could have been a lot worse. Oh God, it's still off the screen. It is still off the screen. Okay, yeah. What is this, it's like King Kong. <laughs> now I have to know. Okay, got the flawless victory run going on right now. 
right, choke myself half to death, right Whoa. when I start to see spots. See, that's when you let go. Okay, so now blue, over the water, yeet on this, grab this. All right, almost have fever. Yes! Plus 416 neck pieces. What am I doing with this? I feel like it's almost currency. I just don't know what I'm buying with it. I feel like I'm part of the mafia. I'm ransoming your family, but you have to pay me in neck pieces. How many necks is your family worth? I know, I know. There's always someone who's like, yeah, take him. It's not even a neck anymore. I'm not a human being. I feel like a superhero that can absorb other people's bodies, but I'm a really crappy superhero, so the only thing I can absorb is your neck. It doesn't make me any more powerful. It just makes me look stupider. I just realized too, if you notice beneath me, there's like, I don't know, like a giant cityscape. How did I get up here? Did I like chew my way up? My teeth are really the only thing I could reach up here because of my neck. Times 15? Come on. Oh yeah. Oh, this is just like the movie Armageddon. Oh wow. <laughs> I want this one. I feel like this is the Floridian way of dealing with problems like NASA calls and they're like, listen, there's a gigantic meteorite heading for Earth. We need to find a way to destroy it. And the Florida man's like, yes, I will beat it to death with my head. And NASA would be like, you know what? Sounds like a great idea. Go right ahead. 103 times 10.1. The power. The power! <laughs> yeah! Elon Musk, here I come! My neck is like a python. It's one of the top causes of death in America. Okay. At this point, I finally need to be King Kong. I may have mistakenly called him Genghis Khan. I mean, same thing. All right, looking good so far. Looking less good. I'm out of people to slay for their necks. I can't wait. It's possible that I'm going to get to King Kong and it's not actually going to be King Kong. It's just going to be like a naked guy with a gland problem. Oh. Oh. Ow. I never thought I would be forced to get better at something that is like the most talentless thing in the universe. Okay. Uh huh. Keep going. Yeah. Yeah! 14X! Over a thousand! Avert your eyes, Jameses! Oh, past King Kong! Yes! It's human vehicle. Normally I need like a joke to start off these things. With this game, I actually don't. Because as time goes on, you can see I'm using my buddy as a unicycle and then he will boost me so I can get bonus coins. Now I can get, I don't, <laughs> there's two human bodies as wheels and there's one dude as like the handlebar. I don't know what this is, but I have the money for it and I want it. You know what, I want both of these. I can also get this here, so we're just gonna spend all this money. All right, so <laughs> I'm surfing on a man. <laughs> ah! I never thought in my wildest dreams that I would be using my best friends as a means of transportation, like physically. They're like, well, who's driving? I mean, it's technically me. I, I don't really know how to explain this. Okay, so now I have to go through walls that will try and reduce my friends. Well, that's very unfortunate. Okay, we've almost unlocked a new vehicle that is this. I don't even want to know. It looks like a, a roller coaster ride, except made with tons of people. I got a free gift. It's a Segway. <laughs> what do I get for the wheel of pain over here? Does this just change the color of my person? Oh, now I'm just, now I'm going to absorb humanity as a green guy. Well, that's fine, I guess. Okay, yeet us over here. Do not touch the minus five. And we've evolved to the chopper again. I really gotta get past this. Like, can I eventually become a tank or like some sort of helicopter or something? Oh, I can become a full car now. The thing that really blows me away is that like, we're just at the very beginning and this is where we already are. <laughs> we're already had a full fledged car made out of human bodies. Look at how stacked you get too. You just stand on each other's shoulders. We're gonna go to the moon. All right, new gift. 
It's an F1 car. Where's that F1 car at? Take my money. 550 for a buggy? Sold. Well, there it is. Maybe I can buy it later. I want a different color. Give it to me. What do we got? Okay. I'm shadowy vehicle man now. Although I always turn yellow when I hit the ground, which is kind of interesting. Okay, we're, we're partway through the buggy right now. So we're going to get three... Oh yeah. Oh, we're moving right along. It's 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 a lot of assembly, a lot of human assembly <laughs> to get past the buggy though. Bust through some walls. Oh, can I get all three? No. I still have like five wheels of human beings though, and we're now as tall as like a 30-story skyscraper at this point. Butterfly versus me. His name is Butterfly. Okay. So what is this? Who can make the biggest car? Oh, you get to make cars big on on this now. Here we go. Okay, we're still mostly a buggy. This we're not with not much of a buggy left, but there's some of it. Whoa! Okay, now my buggy actually has people sitting in it. And there we go, we won. Where's Butterfly at? Does he even get to finish? Or does he just crash and burn behind me? His name was Butterfly before, but now it's like Butterfire because he's burning in a heap somewhere in the last board. Whoa. Okay, now the now the stairs are starting to move. I like how there's like different obstacles on each board. <laughs> okay. And a big Yetus onto the plus three. We are into the buggy now. That is fantastic. Still haven't gotten I think that the buggy is as good as we can get right now because I'm about to like set it up completely. Yeah, we're at we're at the last phase of the buggy. And that is a lot of human beings standing on top of one another to get 3.1. Okay, it's a truck. Okay. Sure it is. All right, what, what's new in the store over here? Oh, what? A bus? Absolutely. For a mere 700 gems? Okay, now I think we do have the F1 car at this point. I don't know what decides, like, where you turn into it. I may have to go back and see if I can, like, auto-select it, but I'm almost sure. Hold on, it's coming up here. That we have... Let me get past all this. The truck, which is going to be epic. So one or three, we'll take the three. Okay, so right about the end of the buggy right there. Is this a plane? <laughs> you know you drew the short straw when you're the prop. Okay, we're gonna try this. We're gonna go monowheel or unicycle. We're gonna go unicycle to Segway. So you can choose each one of these to the F1. I kinda want the bus. <laughs> All right, I think that's how this works. Here we go. All right, so yeah, this is the Segway. Oh yeah. Oh, this is gonna be amazing. All right, the bus is starting to really pull up here. This is hot. Don't go into the traffic cones. I don't know why, but I feel like they're kind of evil. More of the bus is starting to get put together. Anytime I see two, I'll, I'll take the people rather than the gems. Oh, I'll take the people all day. Starting to get all the wheels on the bus. There's even some people sitting inside, and we're going way past 3.1 now. Oh, yeah. All the way up to 3.9. What new present do you have for me? What could it be? <laughs> oh, no. I love how this dude's back is just broken over the wheel. All right, I'm gonna choose, I'm gonna choose the truck this time. We don't have access to this yet. We should get it in a little bit. And I actually kind of want the car for this. I kind of want the triple motorcycle. <laughs> I am one single man. Never mind. I have three friends now. And by friends, I mean, I'm literally using them to get from point A to point B. Not because I don't want to pay for gas money, but like, you know, their bodies are what that would transports me around. Okay, don't hit the cones. Nice. Oh yeah. Oh, this this truck looks amazing. <laughs> Starting right off with the car. Barely had to do anything for it. Magnets are putting in all the work. Look at this. Bam. Truck. Looking sweet. Going for all people. All the time. We got the full truck. That's fine. I'll take the minus four because there's a plus four. And yeah, we got the fully packed truck. So now I'm curious if a fully packed truck actually gives you less points. That Yeah, so the bus is better. The people plane is halfway there. I still have yet to max out the bus, but I want to do it. So this is like six people. Okay, we're two away from maxing out the bus. Hit that wall. Get a plus one. Plus one. Minus three. But then... Uh, yeah, there we go. Finally maxed out the bus. Someone asks in class, what does it take to make a bus? Well, it takes about 30 people. Not working. I mean, like, 30 human bodies. All right, we're up against Solly. And I have a feeling we're going to win here. Because we're stacked tall on the car. The car is faster than whatever piece of garbage he's using his people to make. All right, speed! Woo! Oh, my God! <laughs> I wasn't so much building a bus with people, I was literally just mowing them down. 
I was turning all my friends into roadkill, but somehow that's how you win in life. All right, let's try a different color here. The color is... Hey, it's gray! I'm, we're keeping it! <laughs> yes! Also, that... Was I sitting on the unicycle that time? It looked like I was just like... Like sitting watching TV on the unicycle or something. It was really odd. The bus is also so wide that like you don't need to do anything. It pretty much just picks up everything without any effort from you. If there was literally like 35 grays in this world, I, I'm not sure I'd want to live in it. Like me, myself. Oh, this is neat. Whoa! Whoa, whoa! I was gonna say it's an easy one. All of a sudden there was a bunch of traffic cones chilling out of the middle of the road. Who put those there? All right, grab his... Uh, well, grab it again. It just seems like I'm hitting the people. It's not so much as having people volunteer. It's more of just plowing over them with a vehicle and then picking them up while they're unconscious and turning them into part of the vehicle. There it is. A literal airplane. <laughs> oh, it's a bigger airplane. Oh, it's a biplane. All right, more wings means more human bodies, so... That's why we're keeping it. Oh yeah, we're moving right past bus. We're immediately in plane, and you do actually have to fly. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, this is so drunk right now. Uh, and having the plane is amazing. Look at the height of people. Yes, finally into the fours. What is this? It's like a forklift or something. I need to know. Okay, four, four. Oh, they just, they're just handing it to you now. They want you to have, oh, if you didn't have the plane. Ah! If you didn't have the plane, you were pretty much, ow, 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 ow. Oh, I could just sit here. <laughs> oh no, you can't. It eventually blows you up. Uh, looks like there's more people on this side. So we're choosing this. Yeah. When you get a bus in the first like 10 seconds, that's no. Oh, oh, whoa. Okay, quick reflexes and just assuming that everything in this world is out to murder me really helped there. We're gonna get the maxed out plane and then fly through the tubes. Okay, well, this is working. And then, there we go, thumbnail hole. And watch this, bring it in for a perfect landing. We have maxed out the plane stack. Okay, we're more than a quarter way to whatever this is. I think it's a helicopter. I kind of want it to be a helicopter, but I kind of don't want it to be a helicopter. Like everything in this entire game is so ridiculously cursed. I don't really know how I feel about it. All right, just fly straight ahead. All right, I kind of clipped the top of that wall there, but. You know, uh, giving the stonemason something to do. There we go. Okay, perfect. And we still managed to max out the plane, even after, you know, hitting a wall randomly. All right, what gift did I get? What is it? Better be something amazing. A twin jet! Okay. I don't have access to it yet, but oh, I can finally do the tractor, though. And I'm actually gonna do- I'm gonna do everything on the bottom. All right. Haven't really gotten to see the tractor yet, so now getting to see it, that's hideous. It's only around for a second because I gotta do my flying over here. There we go. I don't know what happens if you hit that. I imagine it's instant death. The other ones, you lose part of your plane, and those walls, I, I think you just you just explode, and all your guys go flying. They curse your name as their bodies break. And they all get a horrible road rash. Ah, uh, plus one's all down here. Ah, uh, it's better to go up top. Yeah, we're going up top this time. Oh no! I didn't, oh, you have to do it. Okay, because you need a plane in order to actually get past all this. All right, so always go over to the right. There we go. Back over to the right. And we've got the plane right away. Okay. Ah! Oh my god. Okay, the wall actually had its own thumbnail hole. Like it was a thumbnail hole inside of a thumbnail hole. I didn't realize that. Uh, where are you supposed to go here? Oh, you have to take the minus 11 and just like what jump your tiny little say look at how far the bodies went jump your tiny little segue onto this Okay, now the boards are getting are getting like legitimately difficult. <laughs> All right, we got the plane First thumbnail hole. No problem. Second thumbnail hole. No problem. We're gonna go over Through here. All right, I guess we're just gonna land this here. We go <laughs> Oh yeah Oh, it's like the dollar store version of Batman <laughs> flying around Gotham. Come on, I gotta get the plane. Okay, good. And we did get the plane so that we could at least survive. Wow, in the end, all I had left was the F1 car. I've got to hit as many people as humanly possible. Again, I never thought I would say that, but... Well, what am I talking about? I, I guess I knew I would say that. Now I have to go inside of tubes? Okay. That doesn't actually seem that bad. It's actually a little bit easier than, like, the... The little Yeety walls. Minus 22. Am I gonna have a Segway left? Yeah, it's only Segways! <sighs> okay, and then... Murder everyone, drop down on the tractor, and then finish it off. I want my jet! I don't care what it takes! 
You're my jet. And through. Perfect. Uh, I'll take the top ED2 because that's a boost. Oh, yeah. Well, that makes this a little bit harder. Oh, God. And the left. Oh, he died like right away. <laughs> he didn't even get past the first part. Why was I even doing this for? I could have just pulled over. In the quest of. Oh, oh they move now. Okay. Uh, all right. That's, that's a new and exciting addition to the pain that I have to deal with here. So, minus one no matter what, and that will turn me back into a sad vehicle, and now it's just like a slow burn of all of the people in my life. Well, it's not really anything good, it's basically just that I, that I abuse so I can finish the board. 91% were right there. After having a time where I was struggling to even get a decent vehicle to drive, now it's just all plain, all the time. Yes. There's a lot of gems you can get in this one, too, if you have the plane. Oh, my God. It's amazing. There we go. That is about as, as bonus as bonus could get. And the helicopter's ready. All right, we've maxed this out. Now everything's maxed. Perfect. And go over to the store. We can get the even cooler one. <laughs> oh, and I can get the twin jet. All right, here we go. Finally, our vehicles have gotten to just an utterly ridiculous point. Okay, dodge all this completely random, like, nerf death area. Crap. Um, oh, yeah. Okay. All right, the twin jet looks pretty cool. Kind of a tight fit through here, though. I'm not going to lie. Uh, ow! Okay, that's working out quick. Oh, whoa, whoa, hey, oh, okay. All right, yeah! The tilt rotor! Look at the tower! <laughs> I do have to max that out, though, because I got to see how big it gets. Now there's random blades on the ground. I'm surprised the blades didn't come much earlier in this, to be, to be quite honest with you. It kind of seems like they're always there. All right, we already have the twin jet, so things are going really good. I just, I don't want to hit any. Ooh, okay, I almost, I almost... Knocked myself out there. Getting down on this thing is a little bit of a pain because it has a tendency to just kind of like rise on its own. Ow, 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 ow. And it doesn't like turn. So, all right, stack them to the moon. Ow. Oh, I have to, I have to get hit by these. Okay. Plus five. Okay. Minus one plus five. I better get the plane, otherwise I'm screwed. Oh, I'm screwed. Okay, so one, you have to hit one of these. There's really no choice. So five. We should get the plane this time, as long as I only hit, yeah, the least amount. Whoa! You have to go between double- <laughs> You can possibly go between, like, double- I don't even know what those were. Like, like, spiky pancake makers. All right, the tilt rotor is almost maxed out, but there's, like, five people left I can get. All right, come on, everyone. I have to get everyone I know together to max out the tilt rotor. This is your jobs now. Don't worry- Whoa. Don't worry, it's it's a good it'll be a good death. <laughs> it's it's worth it, trust me. Okay. So now I have to go through the hole. Oh, I kind of skimped that one, but it's okay. There we go. And then drop it down. Okay, we already have the tilt rotor. That's great. There better be Oh yeah. Oh, this is happening. And it's nice and slow too. It's very easily maneuverable. Okay. Whoa! The last two walls, are you kidding me? We're gonna get past times five though. 100% we're going past times five, 5.1. 5 uh, three, yeah, three, okay. Well, this is working out quite well. Three on this side, three on this side, perfect. And a, a gift, okay. That was like double battle axes? Ah! <laughs> oh God, <laughs> oh no, oh. Oh, but it's okay. I can just fly over everything now because you get to keep it. And we maxed out the tilt rotor. The stack is complete. Yeah. 5.5. It's buddy toss. Okay, I was lured into this game with the promise that eventually the numbers in it get so ridiculously high that there becomes like an error message in order to actually calculate them. Now, fortunately, I happen to have some money to spend, and then it looks like it just gives you a stupid amount if you do some certain things. So I want to do some of this first, and I'm gonna go ahead and turn into this just because I can. What is with the creepy smile on this guy's face? Like, he always has it. It never goes away. Oh wow, the extra strength really does a lot. 
The other thing is like, I guess you could eventually just get him all the way up, you know, out of the entire solar system. I'm pretty sure he almost took out a plane as well as a balloon. <laughs> what are the points that I get for this? Wow. Uh, yeah, sure. I can also turn this thing into almost anything. Oh, I can just turn it into something that's not even a human being. Feels kind of bad though, because now it's less like I'm buddy tossing and it's more like I'm just playing alone until I cry myself to sleep. Now, if you can't throw your buddy at least a mile into the air, you don't deserve him. Oh yeah. Oh, uh, we're in space. That's where I always wanted to be. <laughs> I love that the moon is looking at me askew. The moon was like, mm hmm, getting kind of close. All right, now you can see I've just started learning, but we're already at, oh, you know, 13,000 meters. Because I use the dirty imperial system, I really don't know how much that is. I think it's somewhere around like 4,000 feet. More muscles, I say. I do feel like tossing a buddy, like this sad dinosaur here. This dinosaur looks so done with life. I love how it's still just a picture of my human buddy as it flies through the air. It's, it, they didn't even have the audacity to make the dinosaur face look at me sadly. All right, we have left the stratosphere at this point. 4,000. And I think he just broke his spine. The other thing you could do, if you so inclined, is just get yourself an auto clicker and see how ridiculous the numbers get. As a matter of fact, I've decided that's what we're doing in the end. We're totally auto clickering this because I need to know where it ends. Now, obviously, I need to gain some real buddy tossing skill without the help of vigorously cheating like I so want to. On the plus side, I don't even have to try super hard anymore because my guy is so strong. Oh my God. <laughs> How many different planets are there that look at you sideways? They're like, don't you dare touch me. Well, here, since we're going into space anyway. All right, hideous alien being, you know what to do. Ah, yes, a classic combination of friends, an alien and a dinosaur. Although I don't know if it's a real dinosaur or just someone inside of a dinosaur costume. I'm going to have to hope that they're real. I also love how I'm doing this like right outside of a gym. A gym that I will never realistically use. I just, I don't know if I need it. I mean, I know the dinosaur is like, for God's sakes, just go to the gym. Stop using me for this. This could be the big one. Yeah! <laughs> 600,000 meters? What does it even mean? Oh my God. <laughs> oh, wow. What? It's that doesn't actually seem like a normal planet anymore. I love how the game did it like it turned away from being sideways to just long ways. Look at the numbers, six million meters. Uh, yeah, I guess I have some points to spend. Uh, there we go. Hey Google, how many miles is six million meters? Six million meters is equal to 3,728.227 miles. Oh, not even 4,000 miles. We got plenty of space. Grab the iron robot over here. Is that the doge? Oh my God. Grab the chicken. <laughs> Oh, the buffed out doge is amazing. All right, we need big numbers here. We gotta get past six million, obviously. Okay, 1.3 million, uh-huh. Oh God. <laughs> Four million, yeah. Oh, yes. <laughs> Oh, we're li we're like going through a warp hole. Twenty six million. <laughs> the speed is so ridiculous. All right, my chickeny friend, it is time for you and I to leave this galaxy for another more impressive one. We are at a question of how good are Gray's reflexes. They're getting pretty good. <laughs> oh, there it is. I love that you can like pause it if you want to, just so you can appreciate the gigantic nebula. All right, just hanging for a while in the air. Coming down. Go. Go all the way to 50 million meters, 57 million. Look at this chicken. This chicken's like, why did I sign up for this? What was promised to me in return? I don't remember. That was a really good toss. 
two, three hundred, four hundred million. Is that a cucumber? I'm hoping that was some sort of astrological body because for a moment there, it kind of made me hungry. All right, we're going back into our cal. Oh, yes. Over one billion meter. <laughs> two billion. Why? Why do the numbers even have to go this high? Before, I wasn't actually that impressed with the fact that we had gotten 3,000 or it was like almost 4,000 miles, I guess. I've got to find out how many like thousands of miles we're getting now. Oh, God. <laughs> it happened so fast. Hey, Google, how many miles is 3.1 billion meters? 3 billion 100 million meters is 1.926 times 10 to the six miles. What? If you're curious, it's almost 2 million miles. Not good enough. Bring in the angry dog. And uh, yeah, there's fish. Go ahead and spend some of these over here. In fact, I'm gonna spend all of them. Yes. The do I don't know if you caught it. When the dog fires the fish up in the air, the face it makes is so majestic. <laughs> That's a very depressed planet over there too, I just realized. You'll never really see his face unless like I, I stop just as it, like right now you can see it, there it is. But after you get past about like about 500 meters or so, that's it. He becomes a background character. You never see him again. All right, we're going for big numbers. Big numbers this time. I want to go way past where I was. It was like two million miles or something like that. Rookie numbers. Now, first thing we have to do as always is to leave the entirety of our universe. <laughs> it's no small task, you understand, for a sad fish. All right. Now, I think that we are going to be substantially past the the fish's original best, which was 30 million. I don't know what happened. I pressed this button and I just got that many stars. <laughs> what does it mean? <laughs> It's just enough for like two upgrades. <laughs> oh, never mind. It's, it's enough for a lot more upgrades than that. All right. Now, with these ridiculous upgrades, I should be able to go vastly beyond where we were before, assuming my timing is okay. Now, as you know, the harder you hit your mouth, the higher the fish goes until he hits the ground. Then he just wishes he had stayed in the ocean. Wait for it now. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's a good one. Gaining like six million meters just off a of one throw. Wait for it. Now. Yes. Okay. Look at him slowly leave the universe. I love how slow it happens, too. He's like, oh, maybe, I, maybe I'll actually stay somewhere close to home. And then he's like, oh. Now, instead, it looks like I'm going to be hitchhiking on top of one of these... One of these shooting stars. I'm pretty sure that one shooting star like literally hit him. Yeah, right there, right through the heart. Okay, this is hard because it's gonna happen real fast. There it is. <laughs> okay, going past the three billion. Yeah. I've gone, I've gone into the shadow realm at this point. I'm waiting to see Satan up here somewhere. Look at it, it's all fiery and demonic. I'm not sure that's what this part of outer space looks like. I mean, I've never been there before, but there's a lot of like spaceships up here too. What am I on like the freeway? I'm on like the highway of a space or something like that. Okay, I need to get ready for this because it's gonna happen really fast. Oh my God. Okay, I've gotten even more upgrades now. There we go. Yeah, let's go over here to the cop. The cop doesn't even look like he wants to be here. You realize you are assisting in the eventual discovery of entire new galaxies, right? You should be a little bit more impressed, I feel. The fact that I've gotten this far without an auto clicker at this point is actually kind of concerning me. Uh, wait for it. It's like Lamaz almost. I'm learning my breathing pattern. See that? All right. That's pretty good, right? Wait for it. Boom. Right there. All day. 1.5 million easy. All right, well, easy. I was like seven, you know, thousand away. And boom, right there. <laughs> I love that in like maybe like four or five throws now, I can assist in this, this creature leaving the universe. <laughs> there you go. Good job. You look at all the stars just vomiting out of here. Going for big numbers, big numbers, big numbers. Ah, oh, come on. I'm actually gonna, I'm actually gonna continue from there just to see what would happen. Like, because I think it just keeps going. Oh, it absolutely does. Oh yeah. 
Oh, it's working out real good. Okay, we're, go we're going into the billions at this point. Getting very close to nine. I don't think we're going to surpass it, but if I can time this next one, we are easily going to reach... Yeah, it almost looks like a... Almost looks like a demonic skull back here or something like that. We are easily going to reach just ridiculous numbers. It's going to be so hard, though. It's going to be moving so fast. So three, two, one. Okay. And then... Through the portal! Yes! Oh my god! <laughs> it's like the Eye of Sora! <laughs> We're now into the crystal- Oh, hello, friend. Hi! Can I, like, click on you or anything? Oh, he's just leaving. He's like, oh, just saying hi later, man. Oh, wow. I- like, he's still going. 250, 260 billion. Okay, 264. Okay, here we go. I gotta line this up correctly. I don't even know how long this is gonna take. This is the first time I've gotten this high. Oh my god, the numbers are on top of each other. I can't tell. Uh, okay, 190. All right, we're good. I should have plenty of time. Yeah, 150, 40, 30, 20. Easy. Okay, easy. Okay, we're still in the billions. No big deal. Going back down through the Eye of Sauron. Uh-huh. Oh god, it's happening real fast! Oh no! Oh wow! Uh... Look at the numbers. <laughs> this is All right, you know what? Let's uh, hold on here. <laughs> God, it's awful. I want someone with more enthusiasm. There, she looks pretty enthusiastic. All right, see this part right here, I can pretty much get flawlessly. It's, it's once you start leaving all of the different realms of exist, like all the planes of existence for a human being, that's where I kind of start getting a little wild. Um, so wait for it now there okay that's a good one wait for it now <laughs> okay i'm pretty sure this is the first lady i've ever thrown out of the universe at this point okay i should get her out of the galaxy right here there we go yeah she's easily leaving the galaxy fantastic hey how do you like the vacuum of space she's like well it tastes a lot like burnt steak i'm not sure if i can get carpal tunnel inside of my finger <laughs> like my pointer finger, but I have a feeling it's 100% going to happen by the end of this game. I've got to try to get as high as I can before the continue that we get. Like, I feel like I need to get at least into the trillions, I would say. All right, we're into the billions now, so that's good. So now we have to exit this plane of existence and then go on to the next one. I like how there's no such thing as terminal velocity in this game. Like, you can just fall for an infinite amount of speed. Like, I, I really don't even know, like, how fast. Hold on, I've got to preload this click. There it is. Whew. The eye sees all. <laughs> And the eye is like, Gray, why are you doing this to yourself? I'm not giving up until it, until I get at least a trillion, okay? 264 billion isn't enough. My throwing finger is prepped and we're ready to go. That, and I mostly want to see if there's like another, another plane of existence that you can get through once you get past the, the 200 billion area. <laughs> All right, now, okay, looking good. You kind of have to like, Press ahead of when you think you would. That's what I'm getting from this, okay? So it would be like, now. Yeah, see? It's like, almost like an eighth of a second before your guy would normally hit the ground. That's when you press it. Wait, like five throws in, I'm already leaving the galaxy? This is good, this turned out pretty good. This is why you want a heavier guy to throw. Huh! Oh yeah! Oh, we're going, we're going past, we're going past a billion right now. Probably five billion, I would say. This is a matter of whether, like, how deeply I penetrate the underworld here. <laughs> I love that Satan's just been chilling out above us the whole time. Little did we know. You actually have no idea how long I've been practicing to do this. <laughs> okay. All I'm hoping is that the game doesn't crash before I, like, do this. Okay, so 54. No, oh, there it is. Okay, so 264 billion is what we're at. I've got to beat it. <laughs> okay, if I can time this right, we're 100% beating it. Okay, down through the pits over here. The Eye of Sauron swallows us up. Then through all the gods. You got to get right right now. Right now. Boom! Oh! <laughs> yes! It's happening. We're going past 264. There's the guy. There's like the traveler. The astral traveler is like, hey, brother. Oh, wow. You're getting up pretty high. 400 billion! 500, come on, give me a trillion. 
Just give me a trillion. I need to know. 700? 800? It's totally happening. We're getting a trillion right now. 900? 1 trillion? How can I keep going? <laughs> There's nothing else up here, I don't know. It's just like more and more heavenly greatness. You can see all the, all the like cool, uh, kind of looks like uh, Subnautica up here actually. <laughs> With all the caves and stuff. Okay, I, <laughs> I've never been this far before so I actually have no idea how I'm supposed to time this because it's gonna go, okay, 500 billion, four, okay. Okay, kind of got the timing down three, but then it's gonna speed up really fast once we get into like the millions, right? So now we're in the millions. Okay, past the eye. Oh, 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 okay. So it happened. Oh, hold on. I still have it continue. Yeah. <laughs> Screw you, game. We're going up even higher. <laughs> Oh god. Oh, it's totally happening right now. 1.1.5. Can I get like 1.5 trillion? <laughs> We're getting that. <back>. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm at 1.2, 1 1.3. There's still nothing else up here. I think maybe I've I've penetrated the highest level of the heavens. I think I can finally die happy at this point, but I mean, I'll give it a shot. It comes out of the millions so fast. It's like so ridiculous. Like I would have to press, I don't know, like now. <laughs> oh, the whole game crashed. <laughs> it's first to light. You know how some games start you off as a baby? Yeah, this game starts you off before that. I haven't even been born yet. And already, I have to pick up all of my friends here, as you can see. <laughs> so that we can eventually go through an entire lifetime. I've always wanted green eyes. And we've made it to the end. We must, we must fight the evil sperms, I guess. So that we can eventually get to the point of making the very being that will cause the end of the planet. There I am. I love how this guy has danger on his shirt. He should. Taylor? <laughs> no. How many letters can I put here? Okay, I finally ran it out of the edge over here, but her name is End of Days Eating McBeady. You shouldn't have given me so much leeway. You will regret this for all time. I don't know what the acronym is there. Take a picture. Okay. Ah, my name actually just goes straight to the bottom. <laughs> okay, so now I guess I get to be like my next age group. Right, I have to dress up. Can I can I get all these hairs? Can I grab them all? Oh, I actually ended up with the one on the the one on the right. Oh, purple, fantastic. That's what I love. And uh, yeah, we'll grab the Uncle Sam hat. I don't want that haircut. I don't want to lose my hat. If I lost my hat there, I would just be so sad. Oh, so now the farthest I walk is how I. <laughs> The bonus is so cute. I don't think that's true. This is what I have made. Look at it on the wall. I love how every single picture is going to be called end of days. Collect books. Why? I'm not going to school. Right. I'm skiing on the books. This is exciting. Can't say I've ever done that before. I feel like this may be violating some sort of school safety, but... You know, whatever. <laughs> Yeedy McBeady does whatever she wants. All right, what do we get in school here? Ah, an A+. Plus. How come just... What did I turn into? Okay, I know I, I know this sounds like I'm pretty hard on myself, but I am absolutely hideous. And I blinked during the picture. Are you serious right now? Choose your destiny. Okay, so now I have to... What is this, like my clubs in school? Musician or football? I'm going for the big money. We're going for... I probably should have went for football. Oh, that's all the musician stuff that I just missed. Go ahead and keep grabbing this. I'm a strummer now. I don't actually know how that comes before, before like whatever I was before basic. Oh, do I get a do I get a motor scooter? I get nothing. I can't tell if I only get the house or only the car. If I'm allowed to have both. I'm a lead. My guitar is pink because pink is for winners. Okay, so next level, we have to make another child. We have to go down a different route this time though. So you get to actually upgrade this time. <laughs> I don't know what any of this does. I'm gonna get both of these. Oh, we start with two sperm this time. Okay, so we're going here. I don't actually know what that was over there on the side. It looks kind of violent. 
I would love to have natural blue hair. Mm hmm This totally makes sense right now. All right, through the wall. Don't worry. This is no big deal. We can just beat through the gigantic rubber rubber band of death. Uh, remember, green eyes. We're always going for the green eyes because you never expect them to murder you in your sleep. Bust all of our opponents to death. Make it to the end. And now we have... Well, we had a... We had a strummer before. I don't know what this will end up being. Your name is Run For Your Lives. My child here actually looks happy. All right, we gotta dress up over here. So I'm gonna get my fantastic, like, stabbing westward hair. I don't really know what this umbrella is. I, oh, it's just something I'm carrying with me. Okay, great. And, uh, what is that? Am I wearing a pan on my head? I'm not really sure. Remember how I said I didn't actually look that horrifying at first? Well, you say slaying the outfit? I didn't know that there was extra text actor after everything I did. I've got to unlock this stuff. I want to get all the rest of these open. Build. Build what? All right, I guess first I have to move into my house. Here we go. Kind of weird that I'm just living alone right now, but I mean, whatever, I guess. Was this where my... Oh, I thought it was maybe where a dog would live. For some reason, I have a bunch of pet pigs. Oh my God, they generate gems for me. Yeah, whatever, whatever other farm animal I need of. Oh, it's a human. Oh, this was my other character. We're all part of the same horrible universe. <laughs> I'm not sure the two of us should be, wow, existing in the same environment. Great, I got some gems and some deer antlers. That makes sense. All right, we're doing book collecting again. For some reason, I have to be well-educated in order to murder most of the planet. Don't ask me why. I'm going for straight A's this time. I feel like the person that inevitably causes the entirety of the planet to die should have gotten probably good grades. I want to get the picture right when he blinks. I think I missed. All right. We're, we're becoming an astronaut this time. All right, I'm a dreamer. Uh-huh. Into a trainee. Picking up this hair. Oh, what happened? I thought I would get the green hair, too. <laughs> Go, what is it? Oh, I'm only halfway to my goals, and I look like an idiot. Run for your lives. Reaching there. Reaching there what? I got a present. It's a terrible outfit and some traffic cones. My father is literally the devil. I finally get to be a devil. Oh, I just realized my mom has red eyes, too. See, each time you get reincarnated, it gets stupider and stupider. <laughs> oh, my God. We're going full demon. Okay, so... Now we have like hyper slow. That's interesting. Yeah, give me the red eyes. If we're gonna do this, we're doing this all the way, man. We're not gonna go halfway if we're gonna ruin the entire planet. I kind of thought about being like a blonde haired demon. I would just get made fun of by all, by all of my demonic friends. What does a demon grow up to be? Jotaro! <laughs> we're keeping this name. Oh my god, Jotaro it is. <laughs> Look at the. We were blessed. Oh, really? <laughs> All right, everyone. Demonic Jotaro here. I'm here to. I don't know. Wow. <laughs> okay, so now I actually have to, like, get out of the ray of violent spray paint. No, I don't want. No! Are those. Oh, they're horns. I thought they were traffic cones that I was wearing on my head. Why are all of you children clapping for me? You're all going to die. This is my newest child. I'm growing so fast. I'm also going to be so strong. I'm going to be like punching straight through people's organs pretty soon. Do I have to like ride my books on top of lava? What kind of school? Oh, that's right. A, a demon school. I was going to say, what kind of school does a child have to navigate lava? That is the face of a serial killer. School was easy. Oh, I get to unlock the next level. Be a professor or be a devil? Hmm, it's such a difficult choice to make. I think I'll go with devil. Yay. I'm a grimmer. I don't, oh, I don't, oh, I don't want no education. <laughs> That would be terrible. All right, I'm Lucifer. I'm an overlord. <laughs> yes, I am carrying the skulls of those who have opposed me. All right, I'm the overlord. I've got a full tail now. Okay, here we go. <laughs> All right, I gotta make my money here. All right. Oh yeah. Oh, we're making the stacks. I I never thought it would get to this point. I don't really know what like the overlord needs a bunch of money for. It doesn't make a ton of sense to me. But I mean, oh, I get to see what kind of car I'm gonna drive. All right, I can buy that one. I can buy that one. I got. Oh, it's a demonic tank. <laughs> I wasn't sure that it could get any weirder. I'm literally going to be an alien now. I mean, whatever. I guess if you can be a demon, there's no reason you can't eventually be an alien. Let's do this. I mean, you wouldn't have known. I guess aliens are just born the same way everyone else is. I'm going to be a female alien this time. We definitely want 
the purple skin. I don't know why trying to be born as an alien you have to deal with like like gigantic mallets trying to crush you. Obviously grab the pink hair over here. We will now violently assassinate anyone that gets in our way and eat them like cannibals. And now we can finally make the very first alien overlord child to go right next to our demon child. That is Phantom Kim for an alien. Say hello to a vote for me as a vote for the eventual heat death of the universe. All I can think about is what does like a, what does an alien child want to be when they grow up? I'm kind of curious. I definitely want to wear this hat. And uh, yeah, we'll wear a cat head as well. Why not? Hello, mortals. I am going to be your new- Oh, it's not actually a hat. It's like a cat rattle. My options are L for pirate. Why? <laughs> I mean, I've got a big pirate, I guess. All right, we're going to be a sailor into a captain. Fantastic. This is what I always wanted to be when I grew up. What is chilling out of my arm? Why is there a frog just literally stuck to me? This picture is probably the picture I'm most proud of in my whole life right now. I think it says I'm the most potential to succeed the universe in life. <laughs> All right, hold on. We're going to open up the next level. All right, so first, instead of making money the right way, obviously as an alien, I'm just going to gamble my way <laughs> to success. And it is working out fantastic. Give me the Lamborghini. What do you got over here? What sort of, what sort of, oh. So that's what- that's what people from space- it's like space pirates drive? <laughs> okay, where does all this culminate to? Who- who am I choosing? Is this like my- this the person I'm gonna marry or- I think it is. I'm filling up the love. I kind of don't want to, but I feel like I have to. Is it, do, do they have green hair? You know what? We're both having pink hair now. Now, I, I'm effectively married to my absolute duplicate. I don't remember what color eyes I have. They're probably green though. So now dating couple engaged or literally at the altar. We've known each other. Oh my God. <laughs> it's investment run. That's right. Either you make enough money or you fall over dead. So the idea is just like any human being, you start life with a pot on your head and a back brace made of stacks of cash. And then you have to, oh God. Then you have to pick one to invest in. It was either TikTok or Vine, and I feel like Vine has not been making its way around too well. And eventually you ride your stacks of money <laughs> into bonus money, and it looks like there's like a solid gold helicopter at the end. I don't even know. I'm not gonna lie, I want the solid gold helicopter. I just don't know if it would do anything besides crash and kill me, because I'm pretty sure that that's not how Helicopter, Twitter, Facebook, I don't know, Twitter? Which one's doing better? Well, actually, Twitter's not doing great right now. A whole 8% on that. Big stack of cash. Get my tires flattened, which apparently <laughs> takes money from you. I don't know why. I love how if I step on something and I tear a ligament, I, well, I guess that is true. You would lose money that way. Mostly because I have to pay for all the doctor bills. Oh yeah, there's just briefcases everywhere. And then you have, what is this? What are they like? <laughs> what are they like? Gro people tri like groping me for my money? Solar energy, 189% increase on that. Whether or not it's the right thing to taxi or Uber. <laughs> I don't think that taxis are doing anything right now. Our stack is actually getting so tall, it has removed itself from the stratosphere. I wonder if I can get to the. Oh, oh, I got it! I'm at the. What are you doing? What is this? Oh, you have to actually fly the helicopter and collect the money. So yeah, I got the solid gold helicopter and it brought me to a private island and the island is like a, it's like a dog house in here. So I have to mention something real quick. You think that if I could have spent the money and bought a solid gold helicopter, I could have a bigger house than like a mini fridge. I'm not even sure I'm, I'm short enough to get in this. Oh, I can spend some money to increase my starting cash. Well, yeah, sure. There we go. Now I have a slightly bigger money brace. Crash. It's not, it's not like a crash. It's like I have to like roller skate down a hill and try and not die. What is that? Oh, Microsoft Edge <laughs> or Chrome. No one uses Edge on purpose, do they? Even the game doesn't think so. All right, I, I'm already wearing sunglasses. That means that I'm, I'm clearly successful. And is that, is that a golden rocket? How come all of my means of transportation are gold? And of course, now I can unlock the prize. It's, it's basically like the most posturpedic chair ever made. I never win anything though, so I'm gonna have to buy it just regularly. Cost a thousand dollars? What level is this? Bonus level? Oh, 
Whoa, it's like I'm tripping on acid. <laughs> Look at all the colors. Oh yeah. Oh, you get stacks of cash in this level. Okay. Did I win? What is this? Party, find love, travel. Well, which, which one's which? How, what decides what decides where I go? Where did I go to? I'm going to party. How come everyone's wearing party un like uniforms except for me? I'm dressed up like the Monopoly guy. On the plus side, I made so much money I can actually afford that chair now. What are these? What what was that? How Oh, you kick it. Okay, Bitcoin or like dollars? I don't know, Bitcoin? Bitcoin's got to be doing oh, ho, 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 hey. All right, so don't get your feet stabbed and grab all this. At least now I know how you have to utilize the money bags. You have to kick them like you hate them and then take the money that they picked up behind it. I love how on the wheel the prizes, one of the prizes is literally death. All right, now my private island is looking slightly more impressive, I guess. I really hate to think about how much fuel I have to burn to get to the island, considering the only way over there is like golden whatevers. A Marvel or DC? Oh, it's gonna be Marvel. It's gonna be Marvel all day. Yeah. Ah, no, no, I'm 20% tax. Uh, yeah, we'll do times two here. I still can't get to the rocket yet. I'm trying. Is that the devil? Oh, it's not the devil. It's a bathing suit. I don't know. What is this? What? what is this, is this more important right now? We're in the middle of summer, so I guess it makes sense. Oh, it's pretty awesome. Maybe it knows what day it is. Okay, go around here and Yahoo or Google. <laughs> All right. Well, considering I'm like, you know, on YouTube right now, I'm guessing Google is the right way to... So if I, if I hit a woman, do they take money from me or do they give me money? What happens if I invest in the dollar? Oh, it's the US dollar. I'm screwed then. That's not doing very well right now. All right, ride the money. Ride the money. Ugh. God, everything is so violent in this game. NASA or SpaceX? Uh, do people invest in NASA? I don't even know if that's something I can put my money toward. It's like a government agency, isn't it? Okay, so the answer is always Bitcoin. So that should get us pretty good stacks. Oh, yeah. Oh, our money is going straight upward. Eventually, we're going to take out like an airliner with this gigantic stack over here. Tell me I can make it to the... Yeah! I love that I have to get to my- I love that I have to get to my island with a rocket and then the rocket just crashes in the water and it's just left there. All right, what can I buy for my island today? Oh, nothing? I can increase my starting cash though. All right, big briefcase, big briefcase, lots of money, giant briefcase! McDonald's or Chuck E. Cheese? I've seen one Chuck E. Cheese in my area and all of the people there look like they're dead. All right, I'm the Monopoly guy again. That's always a good sign when you're the Monopoly guy. I'm going to ride a motorcycle to victory. Sure. This looks totally safe. At least I didn't leave the motorcycle in the ocean. Oh, I can buy a, a plant for $1,000? It's not even like, does this plant do dishes or something? I'm taking the boat. Oh yeah, there we go. My favorite color too. Like Pepto-Bismol pink. There's one thing I love to do. It's go into work and vomit money all over people. Look at that stack. It may actually be in a different solar system. Hotels or Airbnb? Airbnb! Oh yeah, 75 times over, 75%. I'm pretty sure that my stack has its own zip code right now. Oh yeah, look at the height. Back to the uh, back to the solid gold helicopter. And you actually have to fly it up and down too. Is that, that's interesting. All right, yeet us over here, yeet us over here. Broke, broke what? What's broke? What happens if I hit these women? <gasps> they do, they take all of your money. Coke or Pepsi? I, Coke? Wow, Coke is the right answer. I was gonna say, that's like my personal favorite, but I don't know how to evade taxes real quick. <laughs> Great. <laughs> you learn such valuable <laughs> lessons. All right, Uber or taxi? Yeah, I think we know which one actually made it in the world there. 248% over taxis. And I'll take the times three. What is this, a plant or a, is that a, is that like a jacuzzi? I don't know what that is. I have to get it because I actually want to know. It is. It's a pool, kind of. It looks more like an aquatic holding cell. It's like solitary confinement, but like slightly more festive. All right, we've got all the investors here looking to mug me. All right, so kick the thing. Yeah, if you kick it perfectly straight, you can get big stacks. I'm now basic. Coal or solar, we're gonna go for the solar. Gonna yeet over all the arrows, pick up the key, grab the TikTok. So if I hit this, does it like slap my money out of the sky? Oh, it doesn't. It's just there looking cool. Oh yeah, times two, times four, times five. Now I actually understand what I'm aiming for. More starting cash. What's the skulls? 
Oh. Oh, God, they murder you. Oh. Oh, so now I'm doing, like, literal diamonds. It's like emeralds, basically. Okay, who is this? Ronaldo or Messi? Uh, Messi? No. Nope. Wow, I was wrong there. Chest of money. Don't want any kind of involvement in anything even slightly resembling a relationship. That would be terrible. I love how it's always like... Ooh! It's always like that in all these games. You always want to stay away from everyone. I now have a fountain. Or at least I think it's a fountain. It kind of just looks like my driveway is vomiting out blue raspberry slushies. All right, I changed it back to money because the emeralds was throwing me off. I love nice, cold, hard stacks. I do like the skulls, though, just chilling around, waiting to ruthlessly murder me. Spotify or radio? <laughs> I want to see also, like, how high I can get on my money. Like, right now, we're decently high, but I feel like you can get way, way taller. All I want is to win this plant. I want it! Oh, I want the plant! My life is complete! <laughs> where do you put the plant? Oh, it just sits here. Like, in the in the area right in front of where I crash all the time. Late at night, heading to Las Vegas. This seems like a terrible place to go to, to make money. Netflix or Blockbuster! <laughs> oh, well. Oh! I can, I, I can actually gamble. And as we know, gambling is always the answer in life. Never mind, it was a terrible choice to make. Wind or cold? It's probably cold, but I'm gonna try wind. All right, well, wind it is. I know coal isn't doing great right now, but I didn't think wind was doing that great either. I got to the rocket. This means that I'm going to pollute the seas a little bit more. The fish are going to be talking to one another. They're going to be like, what did you have for breakfast, Jimmy? And Jimmy's going to be like rocket fuel. All right, we're doing all of the gambling. Yeah, 25,000. Come on, baby. 25,000. I'm already rich. Does anything actually go past rich? Like, I know eventually become the Monopoly hat guy, but I don't know if there's anything even even further than that. I'm gonna keep I'm gonna keep gambling. I lost ten thousand dollars. That makes me really sad. <laughs> I gotta pick it. <laughs> oh, how come only five of those sold? It looked so awesome. How could this be? I hate to say it, but like the Mona Lisa is so last year anyway. Now with all the NFTs and everything, I'm kind of surprised that just someone's random stick figure wasn't the right answer there. King of Hearts says, don't break your neck flying down the roadway here. Watch out for the random woman wearing money for eyeballs. That's kind of interesting. Go around here, grab all this, laugh at taxis. All right, motorcycle. We're gonna be real good friends. Told you. Yeet! I'm making a lot of money to spend on my island. Can I ever just buy a bigger island though? Always gamble. Always gamble. Am I literally crying? Wow, I actually died from gambling and I fell off the whole planet. I love how it's called loose. <laughs> I'm not stopping this. Okay, I'm still gonna gamble. I've got it. Yeah, there we go. I was gonna say, I've got to win eventually. All right, Dunkin' Donuts or Starbucks? I'm gonna invest in Starbucks. I have a feeling that this game wasn't really allowed to put that there, but they just said, screw it, we do what I want because, because they're not gonna come after us anyway. Don't you try and violate me with your federal taxes. Come on, helicopter. Yay, we're good friends again. I'm an executive. And I got every single piece of money. I just found a shrub. That was my prize. I couldn't I couldn't have asked for a better item for my island. You know what else lives on this island? Loneliness. I'm not making the wrong choice again. Never mind. I totally made the Yeah, I made the right choice. Never mind. Alright, watch this. Get both of those. Still find time to gamble. Eventually, I'm gonna get this yacht. But first of all, I'm gonna get these spotlights so I can blind anyone who's not me who comes here without an invitation. More starting cash. Oh, God. Oh, I almost got like uh, cornered by those women. <laughs> all right, yeah. And then, I don't know, let's try Dunkin' Donuts. Starbucks did okay last time, but I'm kind of curious how Dunkin' Donuts is doing. Yeah, they're kind of just staying where they've always been. You'll notice that I have a fantastic Prince Valiant haircut now. The guy's wife was tired of watching him have all the fun rocket shipping, like, across the Pacific and almost getting killed. Walmart or Amazon? Amazon, especially right now, because no one can go anywhere. Well, that brought me all the way up to basic. All right, cell phones. This is clearly the answer. I don't even own a regular phone anymore. I guess the question on everyone's mind is, do you eventually get the Monopoly hat for this woman? Also, do I really need a yacht when I already have a boat? Yes, of course you do. You'll not get me, taxes. Red Bull or Monster? Oh man, I don't know. Oh, Red Bull, baby. That was kind of a, that was kind of a guess. I don't really drink 
drink either of them. Big stacks. Okay, so you go from poor to broke to basic to rich. And what comes after that? I'm definitely gonna get it. Like we're getting a ton of money here. All right, slide down. Cut my feet up for no reason. I think it's wealthy that's last. All right, I'll get the gold-plated doghouse for the dog I don't have. Maybe I just put the guests out there. Wealthy. I also look like a Christmas elf. I don't understand why this is my uniform for like pure unadulterated wealth. I love how the jet stream, like the air of the sky, actually follows a investment pattern. <laughs> this is the way the world actually works. Everything revolves around investing. Literally everything. Britney or Beyonce? I... Beyonce, obviously. Okay, Yidus, grab that. I don't know how I caught my heel on one of those. I'm still not wearing my, my elf outfit either. That's bad. If you don't wear the elf outfit, there's no way you get to fly the golden helicopter. Oh, I didn't get the palm tree prize? I'm Floridian. That's the one thing I can't allow to go by. I guess I'll buy this tree in the meantime. The fact that I didn't get a lot. Oh, yeah. Apple or Nokia? <laughs> Nokia. Well, why not? I feel kind of bad for him. All right, soccer kick this. Grab all the money that was laying inside that clearly doesn't belong to anyone who's not me. And dodge all this. Oh, no. What was funny is while I was riding my money, I was still in the in the midst of crying violently because I had just gotten taxed 20%. Okay, I can already see some of the investments coming up. This should be, whoa, this should be big money. Here we go. McDonald's, that's going to be over 100%. 153% right there into TikTok. Now our money is going to go right past the, you know, the, the stratosphere over here. Any cumulus clouds will be stabbing them in the face. Don't want that 20%. I've got the elven uniform over here, which means we're 100% going to be taking the helicopter of power over to the like Sauron's lair, which is basically just where I go to sleep at night. I really can't do anything else here. All there is is enough space for me to sleep and that's it. The one thing I need to make my life complete is my yacht. I can't even be recognized by any of my ridiculously wealthy friends without one. All right, kick this, perfect. Kick this slightly over to the right, even better. Once again, Beyonce makes Britney feel really bad. She also makes me rich, which is nice. Come on, Spotify, daddy needs a new yacht, apparently. Okay, I can finally buy the palm trees. I feel a little bit better about my failures now. Google just went up 206%. I can buy a dog deck to go into the doghouse. I feel kind of good about that. Really, I, I like I erected this doghouse and it's been doing absolutely nothing for me. There was no living creature that could actually go inside of it. Nike or Adidas? Nike? Oh, yeah, Nike's the way to go. I have got a gigantic tower of monetary power. And as I have arrived at my island with my money, I can buy some lily pads or a golf course. I guess we'll go full Florida. Ford or Tesla? I'm sorry, Ford. It's not my fault. 234%, oh my God! Oh, the investments are huge! And finally, with my gigantic stack of money. I have bought a yacht that will sit there and do absolutely nothing because I never come to my island. It's Lady Toss. Well, they had Buddy Toss, so I guess it was only a matter of time before they eventually turned the tables and now have Lady Toss. The only thing about this I've noticed is that what they try and do is they try and keep you from going too extreme, but you can't stop me. Okay, we got like 200 billion meters last time and I'm not gonna give up until we do it this time Also, there's tons of creatures. I just noticed the bloodshot eyes <laughs> Of the guys being tossed in the air. Now you got some normal people you have this being I think I just bought this I didn't mean to buy it But like I accidentally bought it and now we have it There's another person clawing its way out of this man's chest. That's slightly concerning all the way until you get to this. Yeah, that is the thing you could get. <laughs> okay, so what we gotta do here is, oh yeah, we gotta increase our strength so high 
that eventually we get to the point to where like we do burst through heaven and end up in a place that is absolutely not heaven. Oh, I get buffer each time. <laughs> now we also have some special bonuses here. Oh, I've gotten past the leaning tower of pizza. That's good. And the special bonuses are you get to like do a rocket ship, like basically tie a rocket ship to a human being. I'll show you, hold on. So you get it high, 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 and then you use the rocket ship. See, and he goes even higher. 107 meters, rookie numbers, more muscles. Oh yeah. Oh no, what is this? That's great, I'm Bane. I'm basically, I'm basically like, like dollar store Bane at this, oh wow. I didn't know getting the extra strength would be quite so stupidly good. Okay. Oh yeah, my timing from the first buddy toss is just like out of this world at this point. We're gonna wreck it. All right, 490 meters and... <laughs> We're gonna get wait. We're gonna get past 500. Like it's gotta be, right? Ah, uh, 4, 4, yeah, 461, okay. Well, I guess I have enough money for the next level of, of muscles. Oh, what's it gonna be this time? I get four arms now, why? I'm not gonna ask why. We're just gonna go! Yes! Oh, we're past like Mount Fuji or whatever. There's the top of the pyramids. We're already at 6,200 meters. Yeah, it is! <laughs> oh, we got four of these now. I don't know what I did to, to be so to be so rewarded. I kind of don't want to use them. I kind of want to like just keep stacking them. This way we can go like really stupidly high. All right, this is our last throw. So this will probably get us close to, I don't know, like 7,500 or something. 72, yeah, 72, 25, that's not bad. As long as I have enough to keep increasing my arm amount. <laughs> I have six arms now. Sure I do. I like how half of my arms aren't even like lifting the guy. They're just like kind of dancing sort of. Oh, his helmet comes. Oh my God. I think I just passed Jesus. <laughs> it was God. He was hanging out. He was like, what was that? <laughs> Seemed like a seemed like a guy wearing a bag over his head. I'm not really sure though. <laughs> okay, so I wasn't I wasn't sure if we would get to the stupid numbers that you were able to get to in Buddy Toss, but it looks like I mean so far so good. We haven't gotten into like any millions or anything yet, so that's unfortunate. Now you do get your one revive, which is excellent. Although I don't think it's going to get me that much further. Oh, it got me two more planets. That's good. And now he can use a, uh, <laughs> he can use a parachute and then I guess die in the vacuum of space. All right, yeah, give me all the boosts. 10 boosts. All right, more muscles or more arms, I guess. What? Oh, my Bane powers are gone. Whatever, I guess I don't need them anymore. Oh, actually, that wasn't that good. I thought, ooh, never mind. <laughs> the first throw was so useless, and the second throw was amazing. At least it kind of tells you to right about when you should click. It's not specific or anything, but you, like, you kind of know. So like right now, come on, baby. We gotta get at least to a million. You know we do. We're at 800,000 meters. Now, obviously, we're going to have to eventually calculate this so I can figure out how many miles it is, but, <laughs> you know. And wait for it. Now, I still don't think I want to use my boosts yet. I want to, you know what? We're going to get as many, a million. We're going to get as many boosts as humanly possible, and then we're just going to we're just going to blow them all once we max out our strength. Getting so many coins, I want this. You got it. All right. Yeah, yeah, more strength. And now. That first throw. It's all about the first throw's timing. We have now gone to the dark side of not our moon. That is totally someone else's moon, but I guess it's a good time to visit. I still can't believe, I, I guess now it wouldn't be, is that a person? It's like, is that a panda? And the answer is yes. That is absolutely a panda. Time to blow past our previous best. Uh, we got some twin planets over there. They kind of look like, I don't know, they're like, uh, mutated meatballs, I guess, kind of like the meatballs that you would have if they were also filled with tons of toxic and radioactive waste. Yeah! 
And the last throw, five million. Do I hear five million? Glowing red demonic planet. Looks like it could be my home world. Almost five million. Money. I now have octopus tentacles. You know, oh, I can I can upgrade a little bit more. I don't even know what to say about this. Wait for it. No. Yes. Eight million. At the very least. I don't even know how much the rockets will do now because we're already going so high. I hope that they add like maybe double or something. I would really like to get even more than we got on, on Buddy Toss. <laughs> that was a really good time throw. We're gonna get like an extra probably million miles or million meters or so from that, right at about nine. Just barely under nine. Come on, Panda. <laughs> I, got, I got a one way trip to you. Back to you, back to the old homeland. <laughs> old Pandonia or wherever it was from. <laughs> okay, so you do eventually like, you know, leave the actual plane of existence over here. That's good. Or, and now we're gonna upgrade to, oh, bat wings. Now I'm just demonic. Oh, I have a flamey tail. That's hot, I get like literally. <laughs> We're, it's gonna happen. We're at we're we're one hundred percent gonna go further than last time. This game does not respect multiplicity at all. It is fantastic. It's like ah, whatever number. <laughs> I do also like the 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 screaming. Okay, so that wasn't that good of a throw. I need to time this one a little bit better. I really want to get like at least to I would say like hundred and twenty million meters. I don't think that's asking for too much. We have some pauses too. Ugh! I don't really know what the pause does. I mean, at some point, I guess I could check, but. Uh, 108, all right. 2,000 coins. Is level 10 gonna be like the, the maximum? Now I'm trying to really get that first throw like as ridiculous as possible. Cause you gotta wait like right until the end. Now, that first throw. Okay, so one. 16, all right, leaving past the Eye of Destiny. Oh, the Eye of Destiny is pulling us back in. It's okay though, I still have two more throws. So it's gonna be all right. And... Yeah! I think I should probably cook on this too. This way when the time comes, I'll actually be able to use it instead of like totally forgetting about it. I'd really like to get past the Eye of Destiny. It is like holding us very strongly within its black hole-like grasp. And... Uh, I love it when endangered species like pandas get the opportunity to visit, you know, like different cosmos and stuff like that. Oh, it's so close. We almost, oh, now he's just gonna sit there in another dimension. All right, ready? Level 10. I now am, I have angelic wings. Okay, so apparently angels are just flat out stronger than demons. Didn't know that. All right, so 120, 130. You know what, I'll, I'll use one boost. No, no, I gotta save him, I, I, we gotta save him, we gotta save him, we gotta go all the way to the end. Yay! Well, that yeet was actually pretty good. Usually I only end up getting, you know, a couple of million miles, but that's probably a good, like, five right there. You know what, yeah, I'm gonna see what this does. I did, I, I'm not really that sure. I think maybe it, like, timed it for me, like, it knew the right time to click or something? I mean, well, yeah, sure, give me more of them. Okay, we're at the next level. I also get this weird burger. Oh, he's, I'm the burger! <laughs> That's what I think of! <laughs> Why? <laughs> Being this burger literally just messed with my mojo. <laughs> My throwing mojo, I wasn't even ready to click the button because I couldn't believe that it was basically like a slice of tomato throwing this guy up in the air. So now we're at 200 million. Now again, million is obviously not as good as billion, which is where we need to be. So 200 million, eh, we'll probably get like two, you know, 205, uh, 206. All right, so we're finishing up right around 209. Oh yeah. My first throw was impeccable. 225, quarter of a billion meters up in the air. That's what we call timing. I would love to have been the guy who got paid just to scream into the microphone. Like I scream a lot, but this isn't even intelligible screaming. It's just like, ah, and that's it. They're like, all right, listen, the samples that you gave us were really, <clears throat> were really good. 
But can you sound like you're a little bit more in pain? Like imagine someone is trying to do dental work with an angle grinder. Make the kind of scream that you would make for that. What is literally more powerful than a burger? Like I need to know. Oh my God. Oh yeah. I'll take it. I feel like we're going to get to a billion a lot faster than I thought we would. I kind of figured this would be extremely difficult to get to that point. Now a billion really isn't seeming that far away anymore. <laughs> 275 million. I have upgraded to this octopus and it is absolutely hideous, but God, it's powerful. <laughs> What do you think? 345? 342? Yeah, 342. This is one of those instances where you need to ask, Hey Google, how many miles is 342 million meters? 342 million meters is equal to 212,508.948 miles. Oh, that sounds like rookie miles. We're not done yet. I have now upgraded to this guy. How strong is this guy, you might ask? Bro, that's strong. Well, I guess we're gonna get pretty close to half a billion in short order here. Am I like Bebop from the Ninja Turtles now? I can't remember, is that Bebop or Rock, or rock Steady? I'm really not sure. What do you think, 500 million? Now, 420. Nice. Yeah, pretty close, 427. I am now the police officer. I love how he doesn't even look impressed. Like, you're one of the strongest people in the entirety of the game. And he's just like, man, I wish I was not here. 482 million now. All right, so that one we capped out at about 490. Just to kind of let people know where I am right now. I have uh, gotten this football player at this point. And uh, yeah, we're past 800 million miles. You know, no big deal. I think I remember this guy from Buddy Toss. I'm pretty sure this is gonna be the dude that gets us over 1 billion miles. Oh, it's not gonna be that close. It's only gonna be like 916 million. I tried one of the little blast off guys just to see. You can only use him one at a time. So there, I guess there's no reason really not to use it. So here, we'll, we'll use it the second we can to get at least 1 billion over here. So we'll use it like that, like now. Yeah, see, 29 or 990. Almost there. We're gonna get it this time 100%. I've got 63 of these just sitting around doing nothing. So I've got plenty to use. Are you ready? <laughs> the time has come. The name of this game is Lady Toss, but I have not tossed any ladies yet. So I figured if I'm going to go for the max height that I've ever gotten, I'm going to use a lady. We're also gonna use all of our extra little bonus items here. <laughs> Just to see what happens. Okay, so 1.46 billion. Okay, now we'll go ahead and use the uh, the frozen ice over here. Bam, that gets you basically like a, like a perfect shot. Okay, so that's gonna be 4.81, but we can also blast off to get us at 9.3. I gotta get 1.5 billion at the very least. Oh, get ready for it. Get ready for it. <laughs> I wonder if I'll get it from the throw. I might. Oh, we needed, we needed that last little bit. I'm so glad I kept these with the 1.5 billion meters. And our lady gets stuck in a different realm of existence for the rest of her life. You know what we need to do? Get more zeros. This is gonna work out fine because uh, you see, now we can just do this. Yeah, just as, you know what? Actually, let's, uh, let's just do this. That's an interesting number. So something I decided to do as we added like every zero known to mankind is go back to the beginning so that we can really begin to see. <laughs> Wait, what just happened? <laughs> after all, after adding all the zeros, like the, <laughs> the bar actually went past an area that it could even exist and we got 100 billion. <laughs> Well, our girl literally isn't coming back. She's just going to stay up there forever. It's Tall Man Run. Tall Man Run is one of those games where the entire purpose is to get like taller and fatter to the point where you can eventually just bludgeon your opponent at the end to death. I think I just lost an entire leg right there. 
Luckily, this is also a game where you can win by throwing money at the problem. So as you can see, we can do things such as increase the height that we get, increase the width that we get, or do whatever this is. I'm not, I'm not actually sure I want to go any faster. I just want to get taller. And wider. And taller. And wider. You know what? Give me, like, a lot of these. Yeah, keep that going. All right, let's see what that does. I haven't actually gotten the opportunity to murder the guy at the end yet. Okay, I am getting freakishly tall right now. I, I... What do you have to do here? Ow! You just lose part of your body. There's really no way out. This is what happens when you don't eat your vegetables. All right, finally, I get to increase my width a little bit. 300 height? Okay, so I feel like I should have taken the width instead of the height. What do these guys do? Oh, you just bludgeoned them to death! Oh, yeah! Oh, no. I can barely move. I'm like a giant bloated cheese stick. Basically, all I am is what happens when you combine the Kool-Aid guy and a cheese doodle. I'm kind of surprised I haven't died yet from a heart attack. Yeah, why not? 100 up. Let's do this. And up and over. Grab all this. I'm so un <laughs> ungodly slow. I think this is the fattest I've been yet. So I'm hoping I can almost get to the end. Oh, yeah! I still can't beat this guy. <laughs> How did this happen? It was like the saddest jump kick ever. I weigh like eight ounces. Fantastic. I now have a hat and a cooler body. All right, more. More. There, that's a good start. Okay, 75, 20. All I gotta do is dodge this, no big deal. We got some multipliers down here. There's random bombs floating around. Okay, so that, and then there we go. Oh yeah, that's perfect. This is probably the best run, and not only will I drive my way through the heart of Trent, New Jersey, but I will also deliver the skull-crushing jump kick that will mentally cripple this thing till the end of time. Welcome to the bonus level. What am I, infiltrating Disney World? Woo. Do I get a buddy? Does this guy get to follow me? Oh, he totally does. Yeah, give me a hundred of those. Can I, I get another guy? Yeah. This is fantastic. I don't think I've ever had anything like this. All right, we're all getting wider, wider, taller. <laughs> Grab all this. I don't really know what's supposed to happen here. Do we do we split into groups and just each go head to head with someone a la like Street Fighter or something? Oh, we do. All right, everyone. <laughs> Sorry to help you out a little bit. How come the height goes first and I'm just left with like 35 chins? All right, go around the random bombs. I kind of been wondering what I'm walking on. It looks like an airhead. You know, the, the candy airheads? The white ones where you don't know what flavor it is. It's the flavor of sadness. Ooh, multiplication. I knew math would eventually be good for something in my life. And the big jump. The problem was with no width. I don't actually think I can make it to the end. I was totally wrong. How many more of these things do I have to murder before they stop chilling out atop an unpainted Captain America shield? Might as well spend more money. All right, I'm now at level 25 in almost everything. Now let me just not drown myself to death. Okay. So division by one is always what you want to do. The problem is I can't get past this without like, you know, losing part of my soul. This is what it looks like when you lose part of your soul. Ow. And the big jump down. This is totally going to get to the end. Tell you. I'm not gonna be happy until I can get to a point in the game where I'm literally taller than the thing that I'm kicking in the face. I'm gonna kinda real smoothly move around this. Oh, there we go. Pass this. Times two. <laughs> Yay! Okay, shuffle over here. Shuffle sadly over here. Plus 25. And then a minus 250 or a divided by two. I have no idea what I have right now. I look like a dumbbell that's made out of melted ice cream. I'm gonna take this one. I'm pretty sure this can make it to the end, but I'm still nowhere near big enough to the point that I want to be to kill this thing. I now have the USA hat. Why? No one really knows. I am absurdly large right now. Wait for it, go. Come on. 
Okay, perfect. Again, it's not a matter of being big enough to kill this guy right now. It's just a matter of not looking like a giant silver chicken nugget. Plus 150. Plus 50. Come on, baby. Times two. And there's absolutely nothing else for me to get. That was a flawless run for the grand total of- Oh, I didn't get decapitated! Unbelievable! USA! You may be asking yourself, Gray, what even are those gemstones that you keep picking up? Those are the souls of the people who are not fortunate enough to just eat chocolate icing for dinner. You don't look like I do without taking in thousands and thousands of completely useless calories. Ow, ow. Even though I lost most of my ribcage, I can still defeat you. So do you want to start tall or wide? The answer, wide. Out of the way. Oh yeah, oh, we're getting tons of points here. Wait for it. Wait for it. Go! Uh-huh. Oh yeah, this is happening. Okay, now the question is, can I, as someone who now looks like the Michelin Man, get to the end of this? Nope. Ah, it's just my head! Come on! Plus 100. Plus times three. No, why do these barriers have to be here? Yay! I feel like if I did have a... <laughs> I'm the smallest you could possibly be to get to the end. I was gonna say, I feel like if there was a trampoline for me, I would have broken it. Like, all those springs would have just given way. I would have fallen through the Earth's crust down to the core and then been evaporated in the heat. I am like a human dachshund right now. Like the dog. Okay, well now I'm just like a normal human. This is all about patience. That's what this is. Look at what patience gets you. Why is there a rainbow in front of me? What does that mean? That's just the area where I get like multipliers, right? It's not something different, is it? Ah! I wasn't prepared for this! Ow, 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 ow. Ah, uh, you know, this one's gonna be close. Yeah, it is the rainbow that I lose all of the organs that I've spent just hours grafting onto my body from the other fallen stick men around me. Hello, random pirate ship. Not exactly sure what you're doing here but I'm not unhappy to see you. No joke, these pirate ships are unbelievably good luck. I'm basically as wide and as short as you can almost be and still manage to complete this level. Look, <laughs> see? That's what you get for not hydrating correctly. Yeah. Stay off that cell phone. Ah, yes, the power of arithmetic. There's, wow. The power of arithmetic has caused me to get terribly high cholesterol. Times one, times one means nothing. It doesn't do anything for me. Plus 100 does a lot. A jump, and oh, this is awful. Oh God, uh, that worked. So minus 25, oh, or I could just bounce over this. And plus 25 more, and then I don't have any choice. I can either get Skinnier or shorter? Uh, let's go shorter. Because I know for certain this body right here, this incredible doughish figure will allow me to win. I burned all my calories in order to kill you. You should be proud. Now cough up the gems. Cough them up or I'll rip them out of your bloodstream. Oh, give me the height. Mew, 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 mew. More, more. Oh, this is gonna be a perfect run. Nope. Oh, never mind. It's totally not. I'll take this. I have no idea if this height can actually make this work. Totally can. Great. I now have a crown. You know what that means? It means if I don't get tall enough to beat the board, I can stab myself to death with it. Ooh. There we are. Oh, okay. Just gotta maneuver your way around this. It's like limboing, except if you were shaped like a giant summer sausage. And the summer sausage is successful. Give me the multipliers. Hate yourself. Uh. Oh, 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 my thighs are so wide. I never skip leg day. And yeet, and grab, and another perfect run. This is what I look like when I'm killing him. I love it. You just got beat by a blue corn dog. How's it feel? He's like, like it's high in nitrates. I like these recent boards right now because I think there's actually a way for me to get both of these. Uh, hold on. Go. There we go, yeah! No problem! I can probably get all the gems too! 
I just have to stand here. You would have thought, consider three hours later. Considering I have thighs made out of bloated Tootsie Rolls, that I would have been big enough to get all this. Oh, I totally can. I can just hang out right here. Yeah, what goes around comes around. It's just smashing me in the left butt cheek. Oh, I love it. Again. Uh, uh, uh. All right. And 200. 100. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this is the biggest I've ever been so far, attacking this guy. Yeah, this is definitely the biggest body. I am now getting to the point where I am easily the side of his chest cavity. Okay, times three to start into an immediate times two. And we're gonna slowly roll around the corner. Big plus 25 with the ultimate width. In fact, I'm so wide, I actually don't think I can get any wider. Like me getting this is just superfluous at this point. Do I wanna be shorter or wider? Always shorter. Height is overrated. I'm telling you, watch, see? It's only now that I realize how big I was in the last level, because if you look, I'm just the size of one of his toenails. Wow, I am now tall in space. Times two, times three. Yeah, I'll take a minus 15. Now everyone on Earth gets to watch me drop kick this guy in the teeth. Say hello to the vacuum of space. Enjoy coughing out your own esophagus. I'm gonna go chill out on the moon. Wider. So times three or plus 150. I feel like the answer is times three. I think this is probably the tallest I've gotten and it's only getting worse. <laughs> so if there's anything about width that I can take, I'm definitely going to take it. Because right now I'm at like maximum height. Yes, he's divided by three width. Give it to me. <laughs> there's no way this can win. <laughs> ow, 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 I can totally win. Ah! Get wrecked! I'm almost as tall as this guy! I weigh like four ounces, but I'm almost as tall as him! Okay, times one is pointless, so we'll take the plus 15. I love how it's like, yeah, would you like a multiplier of absolutely nothing? Well, not really. Okay. Yeah. Give me that last one. Give me the last one. There it is. Now I'll take a times three. Now you can go to your math teacher and she'll be like, what's two times three? And you can say planetary destruction. I need a special move name for this algebraic kick. Okay, this is one of the best sizes I've gotten yet. Um, We're gonna take, well, I guess I'm taking that. I don't really have a choice. I kind of messed that up. That's fine though. I think that we're still gonna get to the end and win this. Oh yeah. Look at that, I still had a couple strips of bacon in my system. I've decided that him like losing body parts whenever he gets hit by something is too morbid. So now I'm just going to assume that he has explosive diarrhea and he is literally pooping out large chunks of his body. I feel like that's way better. We gotta take one of these, so I guess I'm taking the negative 50. Luckily you get lots of growth right after it. I love how it's plus 50 or minus zero. I wonder if I can eventually divide by zero in this game. That would be great. Uh, divided by three or a hundred? I'll take the hundred? Yeah, that, that's a way better. Nice. An easy win! You may think that I'm on a different planet. I've actually just eaten so much that I died. This is purgatory. Purgatory! Okay, so this is width, and these are a height, but we're gonna take some negatives after this. So let's go all height, and then we'll choose width, since we really won't have any of it to get rid of. Oh yeah. Oh, this is ridiculous. All right, choose width. More width. <laughs> I don't- <laughs> Hold on, I wanna be like this. <laughs> I want this! Ah! Most of my thoracic vertebrae! If I can win like this, it'll be amazing. I don't think you can, but if I could... Ah! Oh yeah! <laughs> I'm a human pipe cleaner! 